Having doubts installing our baseboards on your own? Santa Lucia Moldings is your perfect solution. Our product lines are manufactured with recycled polystyrene. That's why our products never mold and are immune to termites and other pests. Santa Lucia waterproof moldings never rot and come fully finished. No paint needed. Installation is simple and easily done with double-sided tape and a heavy-duty construction adhesive. Before beginning the installation, analyze the wall type to choose the best installation method. See just how easy it is to install our baseboards on your drywall. Here's what you will need. Double-sided tape. Heavy-duty construction adhesive. Super glue. Premium caulk. Santa Lucia baseboards. Also have on hand 12-inch miter saw, soft hammer, carpenter pencil, tape measure, To start, use a utility knife to separate the paint from the wall on the baseboard that will be removed. Then start to separate the baseboard from the wall, being careful not to cause any damage. With a cloth, remove any wall dust. To install Santa Lucia baseboard, the cut must be quick and accurate to avoid burns allowing a perfect finish. All parts must be cut at 45 degrees which ensures a better fit and also creates seams for the corners. The baseboard is the last step. On the back of the bar, apply small pieces of double-sided tape approximately 1.5 inches long spaced out no more than 15 inches apart. Then make two continuous lines of silicone between them. Now it's time to apply the baseboard. Place the bar in the installation position and press firmly with your hands. If necessary, use a rubber hammer. Now the baseboard is ready for a premium cock finish. We recommend using premium cock to create a seamless finish between the wall and product joints. Santa Lucia baseboard lines come already finished but still accept various types of paint. If a customer wants to personalize them, regarding the top finish, you will need the tip of one of the bars. Make a 45 degree angle cut with the baseboard in the horizontal position. Be sure to keep the small piece you cut off. This piece must have one side cut at a 45 degree angle and the other side at a 90 degree angle. This piece will make the top finishing. Use super glue to join the two parts together. Connect the two cut pieces at an angle with super glue. 